Though they've been able to make human liver cells in a dish for a while, researchers at Cincinnati Children's had a breakthrough discovery when they were able to grow an entire organ system, including the liver, pancreas, and biliary system. These findings were recently published in the journal Nature. So this was a study that was pioneered by my colleague uh, Taka Takebe, and really this was a collaborative group between his lab, my lab, and the laboratory of Jim Wells. And so really the idea was to bring together the, the different technologies and discoveries that we have to try to build this integrated organ system in a dish. A major breakthrough in our study is to connect the liver biliary pancreatic system uh, simultaneously from the humans themselves. By looking at the color of these two fluorescent signals, you can show the connections between the liver portion to the biliary system. Because many diseases involve multiple organs and the connectivity between them, this research is a major advance in being able to study how organ systems form and the diseases that impact them. So now having this intact organ system in a dish, we can really study how novel therapeutics or current drugs might impact multiple different uh, cell components, the, the, the function of the liver tissue as well as the pancreatic tissue and the ductal tissue all at the same time. I was involved in the organ transplantation 10 years ago, but I switched my career because organ transplantation is, uh, has quite limited because donor is limited. So we want to make a difference by growing a human organoid for the transplantation. He hopes to reach this goal of being able to use these organs for transplantation within 10 years. The current research can already start to make a difference for children with conditions that affect the liver, pancreas, or biliary system.